A special thank you to each of our subscribers who make this channel possible. Here's today's story. NASA has successfully launched its Europa Clipper spacecraft from Florida, embarking on an ambitious mission to explore whether Jupiter's moon Europa possesses conditions that could support life. This monumental endeavor is focused on the vast, subsurface ocean believed to be hidden beneath Europa's thick, icy shell. The spacecraft lifted off from the Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral on a SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket, with the launch taking place under clear, sunny skies. The robotic probe, powered by solar energy, is set to enter orbit around Jupiter in 2030 after an extensive journey covering approximately 2.9 billion kilometers over the next five and a half years. Originally scheduled for last week, the launch was postponed due to the impending Hurricane Milton. The Europa Clipper is the largest spacecraft ever constructed by NASA for a planetary mission, measuring about 30.5 meters long and 17.6 meters wide when its antennas and solar arrays are fully deployed, making it larger than a basketball court. Weighing around 6,000 kilograms, this remarkable spacecraft is designed to investigate one of the most intriguing celestial bodies in our solar system. Despite Europa being only a quarter of Earth's diameter, its extensive global ocean of salty liquid water is estimated to contain double the amount of water found in all of Earth's oceans combined. This fact raises exciting possibilities, as Earth's oceans are thought to have been the cradle of life on our planet. With a diameter of roughly 3,100 kilometers, Europa is about 90% the size of Earth's moon and has long been considered a potential habitat for extraterrestrial life. The moon's icy surface is believed to be 15 to 25 kilometers thick, covering an ocean that could be anywhere from 60 to 150 kilometers deep. NASA Associate Administrator Jim Free emphasized the significance of this mission during a pre-launch briefing, stating that Europa presents one of the most promising environments for potential habitability beyond Earth. However, he clarified that the mission will not be directly searching for living organisms. What we discover on Europa will have profound implications for the study of astrobiology and how we view our place in the universe," Free remarked. Sandra Connolly, Deputy Associate Administrator of NASA's Science Mission Directorate, added that scientists believe Europa has the essential conditions, water, energy, chemistry, and stability needed to support life beneath its icy surface. The mission's objectives include measuring the characteristics of the internal ocean, analyzing the ice layer above it, mapping Europa's surface composition, and searching for plumes of water vapor that may be escaping from the moon's icy crust. Beginning in 2031, the Europa Clipper is expected to conduct 49 close flybys of Europa over a three-year period, coming as close as 25 kilometers to the moon's surface. Operating in the intense radiation environment surrounding Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system, presents a significant challenge for the spacecraft. Jupiter's magnetic field is approximately 20,000 times stronger than that of Earth, capturing and accelerating charged particles, which creates harmful radiation for spacecraft. To combat this, NASA has ingeniously designed a protective vault made of titanium and aluminum within the Europa Clipper to safeguard its sensitive electronics from radiation damage. One of the Europa Clipper mission's main challenges is delivering a spacecraft hardy enough to withstand the pummeling of radiation from Jupiter, but also sensitive enough to gather the measurements needed to investigate Europa's environment," Connolly explained. The Europa Clipper is equipped with over 2,750 kilograms of propellant to facilitate its journey to Jupiter. For the launch, the spacecraft was housed within the protective nose cone atop the Falcon Heavy rocket. Rather than taking a direct route to Jupiter, the spacecraft will utilize a slingshot trajectory, flying by Mars and then back past Earth to gain momentum from each planet's gravity. The spacecraft's expansive solar arrays, which were folded during launch, will harness sunlight to power its nine scientific instruments, as well as its electronics and other subsystems. As NASA embarks on this groundbreaking mission, the potential discoveries about Europa's ocean and its habitability could reshape our understanding of life beyond Earth and our place in the cosmos. The Europa Clipper represents not just a journey to a distant moon, but a quest to uncover the mysteries of life in our universe. That's all for this story. We upload videos every day covering many different subjects, so hit that subscribe button to stay informed. Thanks for watching.